Hey folks, welcome back to Explominate. This is Battle Mode and I've got Sean with me. Hey, how's it going guys? It's going pretty good. And we are playing Warhammer 40k Gladius Relics of War. We are on, this is episode number 9, we are on turn 99. In the last episode, which was recorded several months ago, because <laughs> Sean and I really struggled to get, you know, sort of time together really, because Sean's in um, Queensland <laughs> and I'm in in Scotland and they're completely different sides of the, of the planet so um, it usually involves either Sean getting up very early and me staying up very late or me stay, getting up very early and Sean staying up very late either way as you can imagine it's a it's a recipe for missing one another so um, yeah I think in the last episode we were repelling the attacks from the chaos and the Necrons and I took horrendous casualties and I'm basically having to transition now into building uh, vehicles, I think, because we've we've long passed that po point of the game where you should be relying too heavily on infantry, I think. Um, Sean's in a much better situation. He's been, really been carrying me this entire game because I'm really not sure what, what I'm doing with these uh, with the Eldari. Yeah, I had sort of a rough idea of what to do with the Admech. Yeah, we, we were getting pushed really hard, and then I think I sort of just went hold my beer and spawned a whole bunch of... <laughs> on a good goon crawlers and push them right back these things are amazing by the way they're, they're supposed to be mainly ai but AA, but they're really good all-rounders so yeah we've pushed them back and we're holding the line pretty well now so we should maybe be able to push for maybe the top city so what are these things these have got like oh they've got loads of different guns that's why they've got four different weapons the yeah they've got auto cannons missile launchers rocket launchers and then you can do there's a research that you can do that adds another uh, heavy stubber on as well yeah right so okay. it's got four different guns <laughs> I've just got this thing up on the uh, yeah. It's it looks cool as well. I'll give it that. It's uh, a really interesting looking looking model. Okay, right. Let's uh, let's crack on then. So, where well am I doing and where am I? <laughs> to try and figure out where I where I am. This is such a long time since we played. Okay, fire dragons. <clears throat> These things want to kill. Oh, we got demon prince up there. Yeah, I'm gonna get a dune crawler onto them as well. I can I can hit the uh, I can hit these guys with everything that I got so I'm gonna try I, I should be able to kill this this uh oh, I can smash these Praetorians That's actually trouble. yeah do you reckon you can spare something just to take on this uh, this uh, demon prince I'm gonna hit it with my fire dragons and try and and they should do a decent amount of damage on oh no why did they stop here ah they couldn't move okay all right you're gonna have to finish that one off I think bro that's all right I can do that yeah, we've fallen back to this kind of defensive position um, around my city, and uh, that seems to have that seems to have helped things. Now, was there anything in this forest below um, Own Mat, the city of Own Mat? Do you remember? Because I've got a, like we've got a Necron um, artifact, an old one artifact that's been tagged by the Necrons here, or the Chaos. Uh, um, I know they did push up. I think we stopped them. I don't know what they were doing beyond that. Okay, I'm going to put Jink on, and I'm just going to get these guys into this forest reclaim that okay uh, I, I honestly usually you know if I've had a big break from a series I'll go and watch some of the episodes back so that I know what's going on but I didn't do that in this case actually I <laughs> completely forgot okay so um, I am I'm building some got an autark on the way I've got I'm producing some rangers and I'm not building a building for some reason it's interesting what do we need? My data smith there. Uh, I wonder if... Actually, you know what? I think I can kill that demon... Oh, yeah, there we go. I'll kill him with the marshal. I think I just I got a loyalty grow. building up. That looks right. Uh, so I'm probably going for... Let's check my research. Sorry, guys. Normally I would do all this off the screen, but let me just try and remember where I was. Okay. Guess, yeah... Looks like I've kind of got a bit of a mix of stuff, so. Yeah, this I think the city here was carrying the other one, if I remember right. So this like um Ulieth. Yeah, this one was I was starting to build I've actually got two uh, vehicle factories here. And uh, energy we're going backwards on energy, that was it. And uh, we can't grow any larger, so we're building a ghost halls there. Which is probably going to drop my loyalty. All oh, right, I see what's going on. Right, so I've got a bit of a greedy play here. I think I was trying to kind of 
you know, make sure that all my resources were all really high, which is basically what's happening. It might be worth building a, um, what should we go for? All right, well, I'm going to expand our map because I need more population and I want to try and, um, I've got my vehicle production going pretty well there now, but I want to get the infantry production going as well because that the strategy here was that I set up a mat as a forward base to just pump units out to counter yeah. whatever they were throwing at us, which worked really well. And now that we've taken the ground here, I want to hold it and then push into that top city if possible. Okay, I'm going to end the turn. Yeah, it's. Uh, I'm. I think I remember being a little bit worried, thinking that you know, look, we've we're we're at that point now where the AI is going to start spiraling in power if we don't do something. Um, so we've got we've got to start taking some more ground. I mean, we're we're doing we're fighting a nice defensive position. Okay, right. So I've got more shining spears coming out. Where did that demon go? Did he go back? Uh, legged it back to the city. He had one health left. I'd love to chase that down if I could. Okay, can't see anything there. Uh, I I think I, I would like some more rangers because I I think rangers are going to be. This, the, the terrain in this game has been really interesting. You notice we've got all these choke points and loads of forest. It's just really, really fun fighting through stuff like this. Okay, we've got some canoptic scarabs here. I think those things are pretty nasty against... Oh no, they've only got armor. They're, they're not that good. Okay. I think I might leave, those, I'm gonna leave you to deal with those things. Let's go sort of scout around this area to see what we can see. I'll bring these bikes down, these shining spears. So they've got a melee attack. They've got a ranged attack. Uh, shuriken cannon. Trying to keep it so the situation said, Ah, oh, yeah, look at you. Ah, if I'd ever attacked those Canoptic Scarrots, I probably could have killed them this turn. It's kind of want to, um, I just want to sort of like go through these forests. Be careful in these forests, by the way, because they might have, they might have a load of stuff there. Yeah, it could be anything. Yep, absolutely. Right, I've, let's. I've see. been learning that. <laughs> yeah. Um... Okay, this is a good place for food. It's also good for minerals. Yeah, I'm just going to stop really, really pumping out. I think I'm going to really start pumping out vehicles here. Um, let's get some more artillery up. I remember building some of that artillery and it just dying really fast because <laughs> I suck. <laughs> oh, wow. They've got, um, Sean, they've got uh, one of these aircraft coming in. Look. That's all right. I can take them, I think. Oh, they're going to hurt those. You don't want to lose that level 9 troop. Nope. Those Skitiari Vandards. Here comes the uh, Chaos. Oh, I've overwatched him. Yeah. <laughs> fire dragons. Nice. Yeah, fire dragons hidden in the woods. Okay. Ah, oh, he's got the jink. Oh, no. Oh, what a loss. I don't even know how they lost the health in the first place. Oh, He, he, f he attacked twice somehow. I don't, I don't know how he managed that. Uh, weird. Okay, these things yeah, aren't going to do. Uh, you've got some. You've got plenty of AA stuff, though, right? You can take that on. So. Oh yeah, no, definitely, no question. I'm going to park these fire dragons just in this area here. One shot. There we go. There you are. Look. Yeah, if he wants to waste resources doing that, then let let him. Oh look. Oh, here we go. Right, I did buy some rangers. Excellent. So let's get the uh, let's get these guys going into the gateway. Webway travel. Oops. Get what? I... Right, you have to click on it over here. Here they come. And I wanted to get the. I don't know if they can still move this turn. Yeah, they can. Let's get these guys into these woods here. Keep an eye on this northern city. I think this uh, locus of chaos here 
Level 19 city. That must have been his first city, maybe. Uh, Sean's just making short work of uh, this, these heavy destroyers down here. They, they, they actually pose a bit of a threat to us, so that's probably quite wise. Uh, and I'm figuring out how to kill the rest of them. <laughs> I think I'm going to have some more rangers while we've got the opportunity. And in the turn. Let's see what we can see. Sean's activated a control edict. edict. I'm not sure it was actually that useful. I just wanted to see what it did. I think yeah, it's just removing... Uh, control edict removes Doctrina Imperator's Malice from allied units in range. It's uh, to do with... I think it's to do with the Canticles. Okay. There's uh, different global buffs you can get that have positive and negative effects, which I don't actually have any of them activated, so that was pointless. But Oh, I see. Yeah, it's supposed to counter the negative effects of that, I think. Okay. Warp Smith here. No. Oh. Yeah, I didn't have anything that could kill him outright, so I no. thought I'd weaken the Immortals instead. Yeah, he's got a power axe, but I, I, th I don't. I think he'll struggle to take on your heavy armor there. Actually, with just that. Yeah, he's retreating it. I'm not surprised. Right, I'm going to build some artillery, and I'm going to I'm going to see if we can what we can do about starting to take down one of these cities. If we can break a city and put another one of our own up, we're going to be in a better position, I think. Ooh. Okay, I think I've lost some bikes. Uh oh, yeah, I better back up. <laughs> yeah, they, they they just seem to be spamming heroes. Um, the Avatar of Cain. Okay. It seems like he's well armored, decent hit points. Yeah, this is a uh, this is a good thing. Let's try and keep it with what Sean's doing down here. Okay, so he's just taking on these heavy destroyers. Yep, I'm going to finish them off now with a global damage thingy. Uh, litany, litany of the Electromancer. There we go, they're dead. Right, how long, How? long? what is the range on this thing? Um, range is three on the Shadow Weaver, so let's bring this battery in. I'm going to try and keep it behind your stuff just so that it's... Uh oh. Let's see if I can get these guys oh, that's around. Right. I did nothing. Oh, awesome. Infiltration is stopping them from uh, getting attacked by that Chaos uh, Marine City there. Yeah, just gradually moving in these guys up, these energy dune crawlers. They're dead. I need to think a bit better about how the, these two factions are going to synergize with one another because you're very much a sort of almost like the Imperial Guard kind of you're working well like as a sort of slow moving line of heavy armor basically that you know you can you can be uh, kind of just inch forwards but I, I'm more sort of hit and run so I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to spend some money kind of getting eyes on the enemy so I'm going to build some rangers and some more of these bikes and um and then try and get try and get an idea of what's going on behind these cities, uh, and then you know you could just continue crawling forwards and just taking stuff out. Eventually, we're going. This is going to put us in the range. By the way, I don't know if you noticed, but the morale on this Chaos Marine, Space Marine city in the top right is pretty low. Um, anyway, so oh, it is too. Yeah, we could take that. Maybe. Yeah. All right. Well, I might. Um... I'll smash these Chaos Cultists and back up in the next turn and just if we can wipe out one of those cities it should make it easier to work our way down because I think Absolutely. that's the only one they've got up there. I think some of the Guardians that got taken off me have just come back. <laughs> uh, I, I think they were taken by an enslaver if I remember right. Okay. Right, loyalty's really low. Another energy building. Get more food up. Because I'm planning on getting a lot more infantry. Um, and vehicles. Mind you, vehicles are more upkeep on the ore, aren't they? Yeah. 
get on the shiny spear to replace the one I lost. Okay, let's increase our research. That sounds like a good thing to be doing. It looks like the chaos are acting like a buffer down here for the Necrons. There's two cities here. Oh, okay. So they're just going to come Well, the Scarabs just walked into a firestorm. Um, can I hit from here? Yes, I can. Let me hit the Scarabs. <laughs> that looked cool. What the hell it's just that? Like, a, like a dandelion puff. And then yeah. Like, <laughs> oh, that's cool. It's bizarre, all right, Um So, all right, I'm going to see if I can back up a bit here. I'm going to have to be a bit careful what I do with this dune crawler because there's something hiding in the jungle, I think. No, there isn't. Welcome to the jungle. Yeah. Okay. Uh... All right, I'll finish that off and I'll move my dune crawlers back up so we can hit that first city. Okay. I'm going to bring some uh, uh, scouts down for you. Um, let's get these guys in the subway gate. Uh, maybe I'll get one. Maybe I'll get one here. And just start exploring this end. And the Autark. Okay, right. What does this guy do then? Power sword, fusion pistol, so he's kind of sh short range. Mander Blasters. This is a Psyche unit hero. Okay. Kane's Might. Increase the melee's attack. Um, increase the accuracy of Kruf uh, Eldara units in the area. Kills with the Autark. Increase the damage of allied Kruf uh, Eldara units in the area. Okay. Well, let's make him stronger. And then we'll get... We'll get Command as well. Oh, he's, I can level up really high. Okay. There we go. That sounds like a good thing. A whole bunch of items as well. Score. Okay, yeah, that was a score. And let's get him in the webway gate as well. I'll bring him up. I'm going to bring him up onto the front line, I think. I think if we focus now, we could take out this Locus of Chaos on the top right. Um, or are you hoping to go for the Lost Damnation? Uh, I think if we do the Locus of Chaos, because I think that's the only one this far up the map. So if we yeah. do that, then we can consolidate and push down. Yeah, we can kind of spread over to the top top right. Um, and Because there's, there's another Necron City here as well, but it's small at the moment. We kill Locus of Chaos. I've, I've started to infiltrate units around their back line, so I can kind of see what's going on around here now. Um, okay, let's get this Autark in that kind of direction then. Just ready to engage anything that comes out that direction. Uh, I think you've got an ability that reduces city morale too, don't you? Oh, uh, that's the tower, sorry. Not the Elder. Possibly. Ah, oh, I see why my duality went down. It's because I had that transcendent blisting up. Just see if... Oh yeah, I want to put that up here. There we are. growth okay I'll, I'll save that for a short time okay we've hit the maximum population here so we we actually need to go up to god this is a big city now oh what is that oh my god again oh it's gonna die I think. no it's not it's not gonna last long Yeah, that did nothing. Yeah. <laughs> that was another Heldrake. Okay. Probably want to keep those away from my artillery, because I think they'll do a number on, on the artillery that I brought out. Fernal power. Oh, it gives it damage. Demon forge. Jeez, he's still buffing. Oh, there we go. Yeah, uh -oh. I thought it would go for the artillery. <laughs> yeah, are these guys like picking on me. I don't know if it's yeah, just I've noticed I'm... that. They virtually ignore me. I can hang on. I'll smash this thing. Give me a sec. It's because you're really heavily armored. That's why. It makes sense to go for the lightly armored stuff. I'm gonna double buff that dune crawler and one shot it. You watch. <laughs> Ready? 
There we go. Oh, nice. <laughs> I don't know why they bother with those things anymore. Why I'm a dandelion. <laughs> dandelion <laughs> shit. I can't understand it now. That's what it looks like. I know. Like. That's exactly what it looks like to me too, mate. Okay. Uh, can you finish that master of possession off if I to get a hit on him? Oh, yeah, I think so. Uh, yep. Again, I'm exposing myself here and I'm probably going to get shot by this city but I I don't mind sacrificing a vehicle to take out a hero especially if he's a decent level like that. Let's just see what happened. Oh yeah, Master Possession's dead. Okay. Yeah, I'm just going to figure out what I'm going to do. Ah, look, we've got a Chaos Lord just in the below. Yeah, I think I'm going to lose that unit. <laughs> I basically, I'm really doing badly trading units like this but uh, whatever. Go see what else. Gonna move crawler here. back up. It's not doing okay. any good down there. So I've got uh, I've got some eyes on what's going on in the top of this city now. Do you have anything else that can hit this hell drake? Because it's yes. only at one health. But um, I'm gonna have to get into the city to do it. Oh, okay, it doesn't matter. I can kill it. I just yeah. That's all right. Gone. Very gone. I'm just going to move him up one. Um, now, I'm I'm kind of getting into striking range now with this uh, Locus of Chaos. Of the Locus of Chaos. If you are... Ah, oh, look at the morale on it. It's really low because we keep killing all its units, I think. Yeah, that's all right. Next oh, turn, if nothing else gets thrown at us, I can kill it. Okay, Avatar Kane. Oh wow, that's a lot of upkeep. It's going to be strong though, so let's do it. Okay, I'm going to end the turn. Yeah, they're really pumping out these units now. Yeah, I've lost this. <laughs> I've got to remember not to keep going for like too far forwards with these these squishy Eldar units. They just don't. They don't do very well. Chaos Lord's Ow. gone for the... Yeah, that was pretty nasty. Okay, I'm going to bring these Shining Spears back. Good job they can move fast. Um, Alright, I can start firing at that city. Yeah, so can I. I'm going to... Uh, oh, hello. Smith. I'm just going to attack it head on with my uh, hero, see if I can do a bit of damage to it and distract him. Hang on, well, I've only got two fire dragons. Oh, I see. I must have... I must have missed that. That's one thing I'll say about this game. I find it frustrating sometimes because I can't. You don't, because you don't get to see all the moves because it just does all the moves all at the same time. You know what I mean? So you, you don't always know whether. Kind of don't always know what's going on because. It's cool in the sense that it makes the gameplay quick. But often the screen sort of like jumps around and you can't really figure out what it's trying to do. Now the morale on that Locus of Chaos has gone right back up again, even though it dropped right low. That was the only reason why I moved those fire dragons up was because it had low morale. But it just seemed to have just recovered them really fast for some reason. Maybe because it's produced more units. Uh, I'm not sure. Yeah, maybe. Okay. Let's see. Okay, these guys are coming out. So let me bring these down. exploring down this way. We still have not even explored half the map. <laughs> I'm pretty sure there's an yeah, enslaver down here, isn't there? Uh, bloody enslavers. <laughs> hope not. Oh, we can kill them pretty easily. Okay, ghost walls. I think this is a uh, population of increase. Um, clear a tile, don't we? Acquire a tile, sorry. Um, 
No, I don't want to acquire that one. Because that's I like that forest being there. Let's get the one at the back. And the minerals is probably good. Okay. Whoa. Okay, loads of stuff coming out of the woodwork. Yeah, I messed up with those fire dragons. I, I, I brought them up because I thought that that city was such low morale that it wouldn't damage me, but it just seemed to just recover its morale almost immediately, which is kind of frustrating. Um, let's get these guys back over here. Oh, no. Oh, what? Where did they come from? <laughs> I'm, too, I'm having a bad game here, man. Like, I just keep just blundering into stuff like a dumbass. <laughs> All right. Well, I can kill this chaos, or what do you, yeah. need? do you need a hand to get away from that hell drake? Nah, I'm going to lose these troops now. There's nothing I can do about this. Well, you can back the Autark up, can't you? Mm, uh, no, the uh, the Rangers, I mean. The Autark, I can, I can keep fighting, I guess. But I don't, if you look, there's quite a lot of units here. Can you back the support battery up at all? Because I don't want to take yeah. a shot at that hell brute. Yeah, the one... I don't, I'm, I'm not very good with the Eldari. They're just too squishy. Like I, I think I'm used to sort of running up to stuff and hitting them. And every time I do that, then I'm just dying. <laughs> I think you've got to... I think you really got to lure them into traps. And then... Yeah, I can keep... Do you want me to kill that thing? Mind you, I, I, I say that. I'll move, I'll move these Shining Spears up and then they'll get killed, won't they? Yeah, you can give it a go. If you want. Oh, I might as well. I mean, no, to be honest, whatever tactic it is that I'm using, which is this kind of like suicide... Suicide tactics. At least I guess they're kind of working. I mean, the only problem is you don't you don't doing that. You don't really get any. Yeah, what's the word? You don't get any veterancy on any of your units, which is really really bad. These rangers are screwed. I I, I didn't see these um, canoptic races in here. It was probably asking uh, a bit much to sneak them in that way anyway. Um, I could. I think I'll just keep. Wailing on that city, I guess. Yeah, I'm gonna hit the really city as well. Let's try and kill it. If we can kill the city, then it doesn't matter what we lose, really. Like, we're at least we've we've killed the city. That's what I like about these dune crawlers too, because they've got a range of three on that. You can attack from outside of its range. Yeah. So, yeah, we're going to get loyalty penalties now. Get some more fire dragons up to replace those we lost. Energy. I'm just going to try and crank my, um, what do you call it? Ore production, too. putting some decent hits on that city yeah I'll get another one of these support batteries I'm not really that impressed with um, that yeah I'm one turn away from a Scorpius disintegrator too so that should be cool okay uh, researching it so it's basically a big tank but I have to go with it so I can get some more energy out of this one yeah that's probably a better place to put energy up maybe for three turns be alright for the time being um, food. Okay. I did crew hands. <laughs> yeah, those ranges are uh, probably too far behind enemy lines. Yeah, let's try and kill this locus of chaos ASAP. Um, yep. We've got a lot of enemy troops upon that direction, though. Oh, look at that. <laughs> I just can't seem to keep a unit alive in this. No, as soon as it goes in, it dies. Yeah, they're just they're kind of like too squishy. I think they're definitely a, a, a nation that are a bit higher, high skill cap. I've not played this game in ages either. It's like, it's been, it's been ages. I'm just going to have to re remove... Pull, push everything into the back of my base for a little while until it heals. Um, let's just keep hammering on this fortress. Okay, uh, 
these guys are going to die, so let's shoot these crew hounds and run. I hate you squishy Eldar uni units. They're just really, really not tough. Yeah, I think the real problem though is that I just don't know how to use them. I think that's probably the main issue. Like I, I think you've probably got to make you make use of the fact that they, they are able to retreat. So you want to be drawing enemies into traps and then shooting them and then running away before you get shot because they can't take any hits at all. I think they're definitely the squishiest of all the races I played. Even like even the tower tougher than these guys. Yeah, that's fair enough. Um, what else have I got here? I think that's pretty much it for the moment. I might make another dune crawler while we're waiting. Yeah, the disintegrators are pretty expensive, so just to have something else to throw out there while we wait. Yeah. More meat for the grinder. Yeah, we're just coming up to the uh, half an hour point as well, so we should probably end the episode after this yeah, one. Cool. Uh, oh, increases armor of vehicles. That could be cool. Uh, actually, I've got a Catafron Destroyer. That sounds cool. They're pretty awesome, from what I remember. We've almost right, got this, so uh, this city, though, man. You've, you've done a good job taking that down. Ah, okay. Master of Possession's turned up. I might be able to take this on with my hero. Oh, where did that come from? Okay. Whoa, what? What was that? Use mine shackle scarabs. What the hell is that? Oh, it did nothing anyway, so yeah. that's fine. Okay, Jesus. things are starting to hot up. Oh, that hurt. Like, even the hero's really, really weak look. Mind you, that Mauler Fiend, I think, is pretty strong in. Yeah. Alright, so okay. we'll leave that yeah. one there, you reckon? Yeah, let's end the episode there. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you're enjoying it still, and we'll catch you in episode 10. Take care.